Hey guys, it's Danny Johnson, and with all this holiday baking going on, I thought it'd be kind of neat to get some of this extra leftover dough and kind of make a, a kind of a, a small video showing the theory behind a two valve per cylinder engine and a four valve per cylinder engine and what the, the main theory is. So basically on the two valve, you have two, in, uh, two valves, a, a, usually a bigger intake valve, and then a slightly smaller exhaust valve. And they kind of fit within this size of an area. Where on a four valve engine you have two intake valves next to each other and two exhaust valves as well. Um, also you usually have the intake valves as being a little bit bigger. And so the main difference and what you want to think about is when these valves open they don't disappear. Air doesn't then just go right in right where the valve was. The valve lifts up and the air goes behind it. Uh, so it'll go into the engine that way and then the exhaust valve will open and it'll come out by that same way. So on the dual overhead cam engine you have two valves opening and the air going in behind both of them and then the two exhaust valves opening and the exhaust coming out behind it. And so the best way to calculate how efficient it is is to remember that you're really looking at the outer diameter of the valve. So the most air that this is going to let in is however much can fit around the valve. So you start looking at your total surface area and so on even if it's one bigger valve you have this much area compared to this much area on both of the valves. So that's why a uh, dual overhead cam engine can breathe as you know better than a two valve per cylinder engine. So anyway, I thought that was just kind of a simple way of explaining it and uh, just thought it'd be kind of an easy way of, of showing you if you were to take this and break it apart and kind of put it into a line. Basically, you know, from here to here is the area that you have to work with. Where on a dual overhead cam engine, you have twice that amount of surface area around the outside of the valve as you might see, a breathing power, if that makes sense. So anyway, that's why a, uh, a dual overhead cam engine with two smaller valves can be more efficient than one big valve on a uh, single overhead cam setup with a, or a, a push rod setup just with uh, two valves per cylinder. Thanks for watching guys. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions or uh, any other statistics to go along with this.